Assalamualaikum and greetings to everyone. The UITM Faculty of Music is proud to present the Tunku Zain Piano Trio Composition Competition. Thank you very much for your time and participation to be with us today on this joyous occasion. Before we begin, let me introduce myself. My name is Amanina Alwani and I will be the MC for today's event. A quick and brief overview to all of you. This Piano Trio Composition competition has been around for a few years as one of the activities organized by the UITM Malaysian Composers Concert Series, which was annually held in the Kuala Lumpur Performing Arts Centre, Kaopak. However, due to the current situation of COVID-19 pandemic, this event can only be realised through a virtual concert setup. The Mutiara Piano Trio consists of three performers who also happen to be music lecturers from different universities. Let me introduce. The first one, Associate Professor Dr. Chong Yu Yong from UITM Faculty of Music. And we have Associate Professor Dr. Joanne Yo Peizi from University Putra Malaysia UPM. And on the piano, we have Mr. Lee Yin Hua from UCSI. As for students, invitations were sent to few universities and we were very happy to get a positive reaction and feedback uh, and of course participation from music students um, all around Malaysia. However, from all submissions, only seven pieces were chosen to the final round. For more information regarding this event, such as composers, performers, song synopsis and jury's profile, you may access the program notes for the entire show from the link attached in the caption below. Without further ado, let us start. I am delighted to present the fourth Tunku Zain Trio Composition Competition this year as part of the 11 Composers Concert Series. In 2020, the, the Composers Series was postponed due to the pandemic, but the trio composition competition still continues with the new norm and SOP, and the result is these virtual concerts. I'm very proud to say that the composer series I initiated started back in 2010 until now continues. So far, almost over 100 works have been performed in the past programs, many for the first time. This year, we still continue the project despite the difficulties faced, which provides a platform for young compo composition students to compose works and submit them to us for workshop and the chosen pieces are selected for the performances today as part of the composition competition. Tunku Zain's composition competition in the previous years were for piano and chamber orchestra and due to the COVID-19, it is changed to the composition competition for trio. In the past composer series concerts, established composers residing in Malaysia were encouraged to submit compositions for inclusion in the programs. We have in past colleagues collaborations with composers and musicians from all over the world, such as from the UK, USA, Norway, Sweden, Australia, New Zealand, Germany, Japan, Singapore, Indonesia, and Cambodia. Every year, we have about five events, each featuring different compositional styles and genres, different instruments, and in most events, all the works were receiving their world premiere performances. I am very pleased to see so how many works have been premiered and I hope this project will continue to grow and develop. The principal aim of the project is always to support and nurture musical creativity. I would like to thank CalPAC for allowing this project to flourish in the past years. I, I would also like to thank Yang Ahmad Mulia to Kuzain as our Associate Fellow and for us to be able to have this composition competition. Many thanks to our committee members from the Faculty of Music UITM and also all lecturers and colleagues in the composition program. 
our sponsors such as Wagner Piano and other partners for assisting in the project's realization. Many thanks for everyone who are involved in this fourth Tunku Zain composition competition and for all the support given for the project. All the best for the finalists and for you uh, and thank you for the participating uh, in the competition. To all the audience, I wish you a pleasant and inspiring afternoon. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and uh, good day ladies and gentlemen. It's my distinct pleasure to welcome you to the fourth Tunku Zain Composition Competition here at the UITM Faculty of Music. Thank you for your participation uh, and thank you to the great support from the faculty uh, for the huge deal of effort required in organising this event. 2020 has obviously been a challenging year for everyone, in particular musicians and other performers. So it's great that the organizing committee, the performers and participants today have adapted to the new normal to get this going. The preliminary stages of the competition were done online uh, through online submissions. A virtual workshop was done also to improve the quality of the pieces. And this particular event has been postponed a few times since 2020, but today we are proud to finally release this. I'd like to express my deepest gratitude to the Dean of the Faculty, Professor Tazul Tajuddin, for his initiative and effort in encouraging young musicians to continue writing beautiful music for the piano trio setup. And all seven works by the students um, from various universities will be showcased by the Mutiara Piano Trio in this concert, and winners will be selected based on their skills in compositional techniques and aspects. As Associate Fellow of the UITM Faculty of Music, I'm honoured to be part of this wonderful event and I just finished recording this arrangement of Haydn's uh, military uh, symphony to, uh, with some fantastic musicians from the faculty. I had great pleasure recording this performance. I hope all of you enjoy it as much as I do. Please don't forget to keep supporting our local music, our local talents. Um, and with that said, have a wonderful uh, event, um, and I hope to look and I hope to meet you all in person very soon. Thank you, and wassalamu alaikum. Okay, before we start showcasing all seven final pieces, there is a special performance right after this. Okay, and we are very lucky to have His Royal Highness Tunku Zain Al Abidin to be performing on the piano alongside Dr. Yopi An on violin and Associate Professor Dr. Chong on cello. Please enjoy.
Now to the next agenda, we will watch all seven final pieces composed by talented young composers performed by the Mutiara Piano Trio. As mentioned before, for more information on the song list, synopsis and composers, you may check out the program notes attached on the caption below. For your information, two external juries were invited during this competition and at the end of these performances, you will be hearing some of their comments and feedbacks um, regarding the songs or the uh, pieces for this um, final round. Stay tuned and I hope that you enjoy the show.
Hello, I'm Dr. Said. Hello, I'm Dr. Go. All right, so uh, we both are the judges for this uh, competition, and it is very, very, truly uh, amazing experience for both of us to to look at the score, to listen to the music, to to see uh, all the young composers that we have today really shines through, you know, through creative right, creative uh, musical writing. So, what do you think, Yenning? Yes. We have really enjoyed um, each and every one of these uh, pieces. And I think it's just so good to see each one of you have, um, have your very unique voice. And then you, you do what you are good at. Like, you know, we have um, all kinds of styles from jazz to pop to more classical. Mm -hmm. and, and they, they do have tango walls. Yes, it yes, is yes. Indeed, very colourful uh, uh, submissions that Varieties, we have. Varieties, yes, yes, yes. So um, congratulations to each one of you. Yeah, congratulations, yeah. And then uh, uh, maybe you want to talk a little bit about uh, what do you think in, in overall uh, aspect of it, uh, in terms of the harmony, in terms of the articulation. Maybe you can start first, Yanin. <laughs> so... I think overall, most of you um, write very effectively overall with good use of um, harmonies, um, contrast, motives, um, um, very catchy tunes, um, rhythmic, ostinato repetition. I think um, um, I have to say um, there are some very effective and, uh, use of um, different types of elements. Um, what do you, what about you? Um, um, me personally think that uh, the the thematic ideas that they have presented it is very very solid. Uh, it is very very distinctive and uh, very original. Uh, I would like to you know I like to see more of the expansion of it. You know sometimes they they got like very small thematic ideas and didn't didn't get any chance anywhere. You know so, somehow to to expand it. But it, I think it is very very. Uh, uh, you know, it would be very, very helpful if they can, uh, if they can, really expand it to the, to uh, yeah, to to, to the to the longest. Uh, I mean, like to the longest, to the to, to the highest uh, ideas possible. You know, whenever they got like a small thematic ideas, that's I think most of the most of the scores that I, that I, that that we we finalized mm -hmm. I I I surely agree. Um, 
to because you do you do um, well with what you are comfortable with, and maybe you could consider challenging yourself to push it a bit further, like what um, Said was saying. Good, so you. you have some okay, something really uh, a very nice idea, but then um, what can you do with it and do more with it, and yeah. ki- and and just explore and don't be afraid to to you know to go out of your comfort zone. Especially to yeah. play with the harmony. I think mm-hmm. when they when they have like a, a a series of harmony, right, like like a progression, I would like to see more of you know something that that a little bit odd but but effective somehow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we do see that kind of uh, uh, um, harmony playing around, you know, jiggle around mm-hmm. somewhere here and there. But uh, we need to see it more I, as as mm-hmm. what I believe. Mm-hmm. Uh, one thing that I want to to add is when look at the, when we look at the score. Um, uh, I think m- most of the contestants need to be really careful to play with articulation. Mm-hmm. You know? So because because we are having uh, live performance, mm-hmm. and to really understand the articulation uh, among the voices mm-hmm. in the ensemble is very very important. Mm-hmm. Which I think uh, they have showed uh, a, a basic idea of it, and it would be very very nice if they can really expand the idea of articulation and also uh, 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 some phrasing lines. Which yes. Really really. Yes. For for the musicians to really understand uh, the articulation, I, it, yeah. So I, you want to add something, Helen? <laughs> <laughs> I totally agree um, about how, in terms of score score presentation. So because I think we don't, um, you, you you guys are very fortunate where you get like your know, professional players, but also how do you make it very clear for the performers? Um, where with your instructions, with your as expression markings, and especially like Said was saying, the articulation. Uh, also, um, think about like how um, how you 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 have this uh, pizzicato. How 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 can you make it um, present uh, um, when when it will be easily covered by the other instruments? So think also about dynamics and how the balance between the, each instrument and. And also, uh, for example, um, whether it's idiomatic or not, like you have a minim, so you want you put a minim there because you you want what you want a minim, but then it's also staccato. So how 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 um, how is that supposed to to be? So so just things like that. I think um, uh, um, some mm-hmm. of you can 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 think further and, and really check check your score because I think this is something that uh, many composers um, tend to neglect uh, as, far, as far as the clarity of the score layout and presentation. What totally agree with you, Jenny. Totally agree with you. You know, so I think it is very, very important for you as a composer to always uh, look at other scores. You know, to to study other people's music by by, by reading the scores, so that you you understand more on uh, how is more effective, which uh, you know, which voices are more uh, suitable for certain certain part and all that. So uh, overall, I think um, it is very very. Uh, interesting sessions that we had. Uh, all the scores, all the musics are very, very beautifully right. And I just want to add a little bit more about reference. So, uh, I, uh, you know, as a composer, uh, we have to listen more, we have to read more, we have to study the scores uh, a little bit more so that we understand what we are doing and how we can, you know, express our our thinking, our emotions and our uh, creative, uh, you know, creative uh, thinking towards uh, musical writings. So that's my two cents for, for all of the composers out there. Uh, so, um, Yenling, any last word? I think just I listen to more music, not just um, your favorite type, mm-hmm. but <laughs> expand yourself. To the you know to perhaps even more experimental contemporary or um, uh, some more classical works uh, from different periods, different genres. Just expand um, because the 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 horizon is just un, um, there is no limit. And then um, also uh, be willing to take risk. <laughs> And then there is remember there is no right or wrong in 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 music composition, and but there is uh, this thing about um, 
um, just equipping yourself with more um, hard, more studies, analysis, listening, uh, looking at um, uh, different composers, looking at their scores, like how do you, if you want something, like how do you actually uh, present it? And um, so studying a lot of scores, like Syed was saying. So yeah, and but congratulations on your... <laughs> this very com uh, compelling composition and we look forward to hearing more of your music. Yeah, to you. Yep. Congratulations again and uh, hope to see you um, around. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Talk to us. Bye. All right. Now that you heard all the feedbacks um, and comments from the juries, all of you at home must be uh, very thrilled to know who are the winners for this final round. Okay, um, before we announce, I would like to just uh, tell you that the winners of this competition will receive prize monies and the champion's name will be engraved on a challenge cup that will be exhibited uh, in the UITM Faculty of Music Office. And now, let us announce this. Second runner-up goes to the song titled The Final Problem composed by Tan Chun Sheng from UPM. Congratulations! First runner-up goes to the song titled Journey to Tanah Baru composed by Edwin Ng Ying Wang from UM. Congratulations, Edwin. And of course, now, the most awaited announcement, which is the first prize winner, goes to the song title, Passion, composed by Hang Fu Wei from UPM. Congratulations to everyone. Okay, now we are reaching to the end of it. Uh, on behalf of the faculty and also committee, we would like to say thank you very much to the audience and of course to the participants, all seven finalists, you are doing an amazing job. We love your pieces. Congratulations to all winners, but to those who didn't manage to get any numbers, don't worry, you are all winners because we love your pieces and we enjoy them. Okay, and um, I think that's all and thank you for your time and effort. Stay safe and till we meet till we meet again. Okay, bye-bye.